Okay, I wanted to share this with you because, let's face it, to be honest, I'm actually really proud of it. I mean, we've made various models of this over various videos, and you might ask the question, well, why didn't I just make this first off? Oh, well, the reason I didn't is I didn't know how. I didn't know how to do this, I didn't know how to weld, and it was all just guesswork on my part, and a learning experience as we went through it together, being the point. But this... I just think it's beautiful. What I'm going to do is spin it by hand and I want you to listen because there is just no noise. How quiet is that? So there's no noise from the bearings. It's incredibly free rotating, actually. It'll just continue to rotate for ages. Now, it's made the same way we made the other ones. That is, there's a cross of shelving here, which is heavy duty steel. It's 1.5 millimeter, oh, sorry? Yeah, 1.5 millimeter thick square tube. It's got an upright, it's got a central fixed axle, and this is free to uh, rotate around that central fixed axle. So it's incredibly solid. And that's why you're not hearing any noise and you're not seeing any wobble on that because it's just such a solid piece of um, kit, really. And as I say, I've remade this thing with everything that I learned from doing the previous versions, and I'm actually really quite proud of that. That spins exactly how I wanted it to. Silent, free, no wobble on it. It's just awesome. Now, we know this will spin in the wind, so we need to get it into the wind, obviously, but we've had various versions of this out there, and it spins just fine. So obviously what we need to do now is stick those coils on there and see what it actually generates. But as far as the rotor and the stator go, I just think that's, well, for me, perfection. It's the best I can do of that, and I have to say, I think it's pretty good. So I wanted to share with you, I know I'm bragging a bit, but hey, I think deservedly so. It's a lovely job, I'm really pleased with it. Get some coils on it, get it generating. But however you want to set up that generation, I think just this basic mechanical thing that we've done so far has great merit. Like I say, it's unbelievably free rotating. No noise at all. Look how long it spins from that push that I gave it. And it's just beautiful. Anyway, I thought I'd share that with you. It's made just the same way as you made the other things. It's just made slightly better because I've actually had that learning experience. And really, if you want to make something like this, Pick up the welder, learn how to do it, give it a go, and you'll be amazed at what you can make from scrap. Because remember, this is a tumble dryer and some shelving units, and only extra bits are skate bearings. Anyway, I thought I'd share that with you. I hope it was of interest, and thank you very much for watching.